Hi, I'm Mike, founder of GoodBed.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at the Sleepy's Classic collection of mattresses that you can find at Mattress Firm. Now these are some of the mattresses that you're going to tend to find in the back of the store. So if you're looking for a less expensive mattress, these are going to be a good option. We're excited to show them to you. Stick around. One general comment that we would make about this line, and it's really one of the key reasons we wanted to show it to you in the first place, is that a lot of the folks who are looking at mattresses at these price points, typically what you're not going to find is uh, the big advertised brands offering mattresses at these price points. So a lot of times you're going to be looking at the large e-commerce websites, for example, for what options are available at these very low price points. And what we found is that these mattresses offer a lot of features, a lot of higher end features that you generally don't get in those online equivalents on those large e-commerce websites at these very low price points. So to take you through this collection, I think we're going to go through each of these four models one by one. There are four total models in the collection, uh, but because they have different construction types even within this collection, I think that it makes most sense to speak to each model individually. And we're going to start here on the entry level model, which is called the Basic. The Basic is uh, an eight and a quarter inch mattress uh, with what we would describe as foam over connected coil construction. Uh, so in terms of, uh, well, let's start on the cover here. It's a damask cover um, with a fairly tight quilt pattern. And overall, damask is a material that's going to be more tightly woven. Uh, so there's going to be a little less stretch uh, than, than a knit, for example. This uh, ultimate effect of this cover is it adds a lot of surface firmness up to the top of this mattress. Uh, I should say over, the, not just the cover, but the, the quilt and the cover together. Uh, although obviously the quilt itself adds a little bit of, of cushioning as well. Um, then below that you've got two and a half inches of polyfoam, a few different layers, but adding up to about two and a half inches of polyfoam. And then below that you have, as I mentioned, a connected coil unit with a 440 coil count in a queen size. Um, I want to just mention uh, briefly for those people who are not familiar with connected coils, uh, we oftentimes when we describe a mattress, uh, we talk about the coil unit as having pocketed coils. That means that each coil is in its own fabric pocket operating independently from one another. One of the benefits of that is that you get better motion isolation across the mattress. Less motion can transfer through that coil unit to the other side of the mattress so your partner doesn't get disturbed by movements. A connected coil unit means that each coil is connected to the coils around it, which makes it less effective for motion transfer or for motion isolation. But on the flip side, in a sense, any one coil is borrowing from the strength of the coils around it. So it can, in general, be a good option for, say, stomach sleepers who probably want a little less conformance than, say, a side sleeper or even a back sleeper. So in terms of the feel that you're going to get from this mattress, we would characterize it as a firm on our softness spectrum. And we would say, in terms of the cushioning depth, uh, just we would describe it as very shallow. So you're, you're definitely not going to sink far into this mattress. You're really going to be on top of this mattress. So for that stomach sleeper who doesn't want their midsection to sink too far into the mattress, it is going to be a good option. All right, so now we've moved up to the second mattress in this collection, which is called the Rest Firm. This is now a nine and a half inch mattress that we would still describe as actually a, a foam over connected coil construction. But you're going to get a few uh, nice features as you step up to this model. Uh, number one is it. Um, you get a, a, the cover is a lot softer. It's kind of like a, a, a knit cover now, I think, instead of a damask. And it's um, so it's just got a little bit more stretch to it and a little more breathability to it as well. Um, that being said, it's also pretty tightly quilted, so it's still pretty firm. In fact, we would characterize the softness of this model as very firm on our softness spectrum. And also the, the, the cushioning depth we consider to be very shallow. So meaning you're not going to sink very far into this mattress. It's much more of a sleeping on your mattress type of experience. Um, and that again has something to do with the connected coil unit below, which is a 460 coil count now uh, in, in this model. So a little bit more coil density here, um, but it's going to keep you from sinking too far in, which again is a real a good thing for some sleepers. And the other thing you get with this coil unit is actually two inches of a foam perimeter offering the mattress a stronger edge. So that's a, a good example of one of those higher end features to have edge support on a mattress at this price point uh, is not something that you would typically find on some of those, for example, those unbranded options that you might find on a large e-commerce website at the same price point. 
All right, so now we've moved up to the Calm Eurotop model, and this is now a different construction type altogether. This is an all foam mattress consisting of uh, a six inch support core with three and a half inches of poly foam on top of that, some of which is included in, uh, in this quilt package. So it's kind of been compressed down as part of that. Uh, so it totals up to nine inches uh, in, in its complete profile. Like the rest, the last model we showed you, this one has a knit cover as well, uh, which has uh, some nice softness and breathability to it. And this model also has a half inch of memory foam going right in the center third portion of the mattress, which just gives it uh, both a little bit of extra pressure relief underneath your hips uh, for side sleeping, but also uh, just a little bit more material in that center part of the mattress, which is what bears the brunt of most of your weight, because most of our weight for all of us is concentrated in this part of our body. So, uh, so that's a nice feature as well at this price point. Um, and in terms of the feel, uh, you are also gonna get a little bit more softness in this model than you will find in either of the two previous models we discussed. So we'd characterize this one as a medium firm on our softness spectrum. And likewise, you're gonna get a little bit more cushioning depth and conformance on this mattress. Um, still a little bit less than average, but certainly more than you'd find on either of the two previous models. So for those of you who are looking for a little bit more of that sleeping in the mattress feel, this will be a, a better option for you. All right, so now we've moved up to the Relax Pillow Top, which is the top of the line within this Sleepy's Classic collection. And in this model, we've moved back to the foam over connected coil construction that we saw in some of the previous models. This connected coil unit, however, is a higher end connected coil unit. It's got a higher coil density, 650 coil count in a queen size. It does have a foam perimeter for edge support. Uh, so that's, an, again, a nice uh, couple of nice features there. Above that coil unit, you have three and a half inches of uh, foam, including what you have in the quilt. So bringing the total height of this mattress to 10 and a half inches. The other thing you'll notice here is in this cover, it is a, a tack and jump quilt pattern, meaning it's not, instead of having all the stitching connected to each other, which creates a much tighter, firmer uh, surface, you have uh, basically just stitching kind of disconnected from one another going around the mattress in certain key areas just kind of holding it down in certain key areas that gives the surface a lot more softness and, and uh, kind of a billowy nature to it and again you have a, a breathable knit cover here too so all of that works together to give this mattress a much softer feel than you find on the previous mattresses that we discussed we characterize this one as a medium soft on our softness spectrum and it also gives it a little bit more cushioning depth too. This, this cover uh, between the stretch characteristics and the, the, uh, the different quilting style, it's able to conform a little bit more closely to you, give you a little bit more of that hugged or cradled sensation. So this one is more of what we'd characterize as an average cushioning depth on that particular metric. All right, so there you have it. We hope you found this to be a helpful overview of the Sleepy's classic collection of mattresses. For more helpful information about choosing the right mattress for you, go to goodbed.com. In the meantime, thanks for watching and we hope you sleep well. Thank you.